previous video you studied about how to convert a finite automata to regular expression so today we are going to see how to convert a regular expression to finite automata okay in the previous video you discussed you studied about how to convert a finite automata to regular expression now we are going to convert how to convert a regular expression to finite automata okay so we can convert a finite automata to regular expression as well as regular expression to finite automata so both are having both finite automata and regular expression are having equal power we can say like that because we can convert each other so this is the simplest thing so first you need to know about the basis uh, that is how to construct a finite automata for the regular expression epsilon we already studied epsilon phi and any input symbol a belongs to sigma so the epsilon means you can represent like this on epsilon mode or initial state become the final state that is also accepting epsilon okay then regular expression phi means no transition then a means two states from one state to another on transition a on the input symbol a okay then induction this thing only you need this should be new to you if i am taking r or yes then r is there either it will accept r or it will accept yes okay so either it will accept r or it will accept yes that is either it will accept r or it will accept yes okay accepting means we need to reach the final state okay and we should start from an initial state there will be only in one initial state we need to show the epsilon mode okay so this indicates either it will accept r or it will accept yes then what is r dot s yes. this is r plus s yes. okay then r concatenated with with s yes. this is r and this is s yes. okay we are combining these two with epsilon that is r followed by s yes. okay then r star r star means zero r star what is r star we need to reach the final state zero or more com r star means epsilon will be there single r will be there double r triple r so on zero or more combination of r okay accepting final state epsilon right then any number of r any number of r it need to accept any number of r okay so this is the r star r star see here epsilon is accepting a single r is accepting then epsilon means string null length okay r then again coming this uh, 2 r 3 r 4 r 5 r like that it will accept okay so this is the automata for the r star okay r plus s r followed by s and r star okay it will accept epsilon so r star means r star means epsilon will be there a single r will be there double r will be there triple r will be there and so on okay so single r is accepting then again two times two r will accept three times three r will accept and so on now we can see the examples we are having one regular expression and how to convert it to automata zero how to represent zero a state on the input symbol zero it is going to final state one star means you need to write the auto, uh, draw the regular expression for r star that is this is one star okay same thing here instead of r you can put one okay then zero concatenated with one star so this is zero this is one star right so these two are concatenated with epsilon that is this one. next problem zero zero followed by zero or one the whole star how is how we can write zero zero this is zero then epsilon this is zero right this is zero zero then zero or one how to write zero or one zero or one is either it will accept zero or it will accept one right so there will be one initial state and you need to show the transition on epsilon and it should reach the final state to accept this is epsilon 
okay so either it will accept zero or it will accept one then how we how we can draw zero or one star how we can draw the star star means just to add a starting state just add a final state on epsilon mu and just to show the that is we are accepting epsilon and here epsilon how we draw r star same thing instead of r it is 0 or 1 ok so this is for 0 or 1 star ok just remove this as a final state this is a normal state and we are combining 0 0 followed by 0 or 1 star that is combine on epsilon mode. remove this as remove make this as non final state only one final state at the end ok so in this way you can convert to the automata from the given regular expression another example 0 plus 1 0 or 1 either 0 or 1 0 1 means 0 followed by 1 in between epsilon then 0 or 1 is concatenated with 0 1 this is 0 or 1 this is 0 1 concatenation means we are combining with epsilon mu epsilon mu and last state is the final state ok so this is how we are converting a regular expression to finite automata just try to find out the regular exp uh, automata for these particular regular expressions ok this is a homework to you and so one thing is that we can convert a regular expression to finite automata and finite automata to regular expression so we can say both finite, auto finite automata and regular expression are having equal power ok